My name is Paul Nicholas and I'm a project manager in Vattenfall's wind onshore construction team. My role is project director for the Ray Wind Farm. Ray is located in the northeast of England, in Northumberland, uh, not far from our office in Hexham. Uh, being project director means that I'm responsible for the delivery of the project safely on time, uh, on budget and to the agreed quality from when Vattenfall takes an investment decision until we hand it over to our operational colleagues to operate for the lifetime of the project. I manage a multidisciplinary team, uh, including many disciplines, including health and safety, project management, contract management, uh, communications, legal, engineering, uh, site management, archaeology, ecology, and many others. Construction started in August 2015. Uh, we're nearly complete now and should have the wind farm fully operational by the end of March 2017. The wind farm consists of 16 turbines. Each turbine is 3.4 megawatts. So the total installed capacity at the wind farm is 54.4 megawatts, uh, which is enough to power on average more than 30,000 homes. Uh, on site here, we've also built more than 11 kilometers of site road, new build site road, and we've built the foundations for the wind turbines, the crane house sandings, and the substation building. Uh, with the support of our contractors here at Ray, we've managed to build the site uh, on time and to the quality we want, despite uh, inclement weather conditions, uh, numerous environmental constraints and other, other issues such as ground conditions that have got in our way. So far, we've had over 200,000 person hours uh, spent working on the project here at Way, uh, and at the peak of construction, there was more than 130 people on site. Uh, the wind farm is only half the project. We've also built a 24 kilometre grid connection between Way and an existing a grid substation at Four Stones. Uh, this connection is a, is a cable route, buried cable route, which um, goes along through the countryside of Northumberland, along public roads, and negotiates two significant uh, areas of engineering difficulty, one underneath the World Heritage Site at Hadrian's Wall, where they did a horizontal directional drill, and similarly underneath the River North Tyne. Uh, we've had to overcome numerous technical, environmental obstacles on this route, and also have good relations with the local communities as we've uh, been going along the public roads and, and disrupting their lives to a, as limited extent as we've managed to, to achieve. Uh, we've installed nearly 150 kilometres of cable that has now been successfully commissioned and energised and that cable and the route has now been handed over to the local distribution network operator, uh, giving us a good connection for the site.